Thank you for being with us tonight. A man accused of stabbing his own father to death in Austin back in 2013 may be on the run here. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Brian May and I'm Quita Culpepper. Alexander Irvin has been in a state health institution since 2014 and he escaped three days ago. Police say Irvin got out of the North Texas State Hospital in Vernon on Sunday night. His mother told KVU's Maria Aguilera she's worried that he's now in Austin. I never, ever thought it would be possible that he would escape, ever. Leslie Irvin's son, Alexander Irvin, is on the loose. He escaped from North Texas State Hospital in Vernon Sunday night. Police posted on social media saying he is armed and dangerous. Alexander was at the facility after being accused of murdering his father in 2013. A Travis County jury found Irvin, who is autistic, not guilty by reason of insanity. When he's on his meds, he's a sweetheart. I just talked to him Sunday morning. But when he's off his meds, all bets are off. He's psychotic. He killed his dad when he was off his meds under the delusion he was an imposter. According to police, Alexander escaped his room Sunday night, scaled an eight-foot security fence, and was last seen heading north. His mother says it's possible he could return to his hometown of Austin and that it's not her family's safety she's worried about. I'm worried for everyone else that has no idea what Lex can do. I'm worried for those people that might run into him in their backyard. That's what scares me the most right now. All Leslie wants now are answers, hoping her son is found and that no one gets hurt. I need to know what happened, first of all, because it sounds like gross incompetence to me that anyone could leave that facility. Number two, I want to make sure that this does not happen again in the future. In Austin, I'm Maria Aguilera. Maria, thank you. Now, we reached out to local law enforcement about this specific case, but have not heard back yet tonight. The Texas Department of Health and Human Services, which runs the hospital Irvin escaped from, they told us they can't comment on this case because of state law and HIPAA.